Now, against your own wishes, we have the money. And actually, I agree with Jack Chambers, this has the capacity to be transformational. Is anyone in the government actually making the case that this is a transformational budget? Where are the transformational changes in this budget? I mean, there's nothing that can be trumpeted as transformation. But where is the state construction company in the context of an unprecedented housing crisis, of record house prices, of record levels of homelessness, of record levels of rent? Where's the public childcare? Public provision of childcare for free at the point of access in the context of families spending an extra mortgage every month for one kid, an extra two mortgages a month for two kids. Where's the investment? in public transport, in renewable energy, in retrofitting in the context of the climate catastrophe that we are heading towards. No mention of the building of a national health service. No provision for a special class in every school across the country. There's nothing in this budget that can be pointed at as being transformational. In fact, it's the opposite of a transformational budget. A series of once-off, sometimes twice-off, measures for ordinary people social welfare, child benefit, reduction in student fees. Even the reduction of public transport fees is continued on a once-off basis. It's the biggest scam ever.